Hi there, thank you for choosing Foledo Line Digital Planner. In this tutorial, I'll walk you through how to download and set up your Foledo Line Planner in GoodNote 6. Your Planner Bundle generally comes in different planner options. After you choose to click an option from the download link document, it will open a page like this in your Safari app. So simply click Download Now, Download, Wait until the download icon at the top right corner to finish downloading. And tap on the icon and the file. It will open up your files app. And you can see a zip file here in the downloads folder. Simply click the zip file and it will just auto unzip. Click the folder and you'll see the planners here. You may see different planner files depending on which planner package you bought. If you're looking for a specific layout, you can change to list view to see the file name. I generally label the file name in a way that you can easily find the one you need. So for example, this one is a 2024 planner with balanced daily layout, Apple calendar integration, and the weekly start date is Monday. Let's choose this one. Click the shared icon. Choose the good notes icon. If you can't see it, click more and find it here. Or you can scroll down and choose open in good notes. Okay, here we have the planner open in GoodNotes 6. First, please make sure you click the pen tool at the uh, top center here to turn on the read-only mode like this. On the second page, you may see some info about the calendar integration. Make sure you read this to properly install the shortcut for Apple Calendar and Reminders integration and click the instructions link here to see how that works. If you can't see anything about the calendar integration, that means the planner you're currently on does not have this feature. You can skip this step. Okay, now I'll quickly go through how to navigate the planner. Here's the index page where you can go to the lifestyle templates such as wellness, nutrition, note templates, and custom sessions. You can also go to these pages by clicking these icons at the top right corner. On the right side, you can click these tabs to go to yearly calendar and monthly calendars. And on the monthly calendar, you can click the dates to go to the daily planning page. And you can click the week numbers on the left side to go to the weekly planning page. From the weekly planner, you can click the dates to go to the daily planner where you can click the view week button up here to go back to weekly planner. And at the bottom right corner, you can jump between weekly planner, weekly schedule, weekly reflection and weekly meal planner. For a complete guide to how to navigate the planner, you can check out this video. I've included the video link in description. Next, I'll show you how to import sticker book. Let's download the stickers like we did with the planner. The GoodNotes sticker book looks like a zip file, but it actually is not. Just open it in GoodNotes in the same way we opened the planner.
One thing I want to point out here is that make sure you click Import as New Document to import the sticker book to GoodNotes. If you click Import to Current Document, the sticker book will import right into the planner, which obviously is not what we want. The same goes for when you open another planner while you are on the planner. Make sure you click Import as New Document. Otherwise, the two planners will be merged into one document. The sticker book includes essential stickers in five colors plus some extra stickers. Simply use the lasso tool to copy and paste the sticker like so. Now let me show you how to use the free 10,000 stickers that come with the planner. We'll save the stickers to the Elements tool of GoodNotes. First, choose the stickers you like. Click Share and Save Images. Now go back to GoodNotes. Click the Elements tool. Click the little plus button here to create a new collection for the stickers. Add Photos. Select the stickers and add. Then you can add a sticker to the planner with elements like so. You can also use the uh, split view so that you can better navigate the stickers and find the one you need and drag the sticker to the planner like so. Next, I'll show you how to change the cover of the planner by which you can learn how to delete, copy and paste pages in GoodNotes. Let's download the covers like we did with the planner. Let's choose a cover and click three dots, copy page. Now go back to the planner, go to the index page and navigate to the cover page. Click move page to trash to delete the existing one and click the four little squares icon at the top left corner. Click the down arrow on the uh, copyright page, add page before and paste page. Now we have a different cover for the planner. Now you're all set for the planner.
I'll use a simple example to show you how to use the planner with some basic tools. Let's go to a daily page. Let's choose the pen tool. Choose a pen color. Draw a rectangle and hold the pen tip until you get a perfect rectangle. Well, I've made a comprehensive tutorial for GoodNotes. Make sure you check out that tutorial if you are new to GoodNotes. If you are an experienced user, check out the tips and tricks part. You may find something helpful there.